Yep, we made it to the end of the year yet again. This was one of the wackiest years of my entire life, but none of that matters right now. What matters the most is Reddit. I don't think I've ever done this before, but let's celebrate the end of the year with a top of this year Reddit review. If you've watched a couple of my videos over this year and you haven't subscribed yet, then scroll down, make sure you subscribed. Thank you very much. We're trying to hit 1 million, maybe even next year. That's kind of a stretch, but let's go for it. Surprisingly, the top post of this year so far was only made 18 days ago. We got like four days left in the year. So good job. That just broke the record really quick. And it's for a good reason too. The grind was worth it with one left hand. I think that's... uh. <laughs> Sam's be kind of embarrassing to get that wrong, but I believe this is Sam's and uh, they literally did it with one left hand Which is kind of crazy I think this is deserving of the top of the year and the one under that is definitely like the best meme that came out this year For those of you who don't know flash rail had a very bad and kind of embarrassing set of updates Where a lot of stuff was changed based on data that really did not match up the upgrades will cost 50,000 power points though. <laughs> to counter that we will be offering several great value offers. Oh so my you can god wallets please no oh fifty dollars for five gems what a bargain i genuinely pray that they just do not take this type of route that clash royale has been taking then again clash royale is kind of slowly beginning to ease up on it i think i don't know they just released one emote for like seven dollars because they knew it was going to be popular so maybe not edgar eating megs with for breakfast with some happy music i actually remember this post i think this is when meg got her rework and she was super op but edgar hard countered her so this guy just went around killing all 10 people also this is copyrighted so i have my own music on this oh my god dude what a what a good day to be an edgar player <laughs> like look at this bro i think he kills pretty much everybody in the lobby because everybody else is Meg. I like it when sometimes top tier brawlers get countered by somebody like Edgar. He just has to walk up to them and mash auto aim and then he just wins. That, that's how he is with this hyper charge though. I can't believe the Meg is down thumbing. That's crazy. Oh boy. The fourth most popular post of the year is uh, Kairos's I'm leaving the subreddit post. Hopefully I don't have to end up making one of these, but I also don't like actually use reddit i do it for the videos only i don't exactly enjoy directly associating myself with these things anymore so i guess i won't ever need to make a post like this anyways but yeah this was really sad there's a lot of really toxic people like overly toxic all right this is also probably copyrighted but <laughs> it's a battle of toxicity between hank and edgar was hank really that toxic were tank players spamming down pin oh no what is even going on, bro? Like, give, give me to the next post, dude. <laughs> post number six. Two months ago. Some of these are kind of recent. Bro with the one million gems is not gonna like this update. I obviously remember this post. One of the people who won one of the golden tickets asked for one million gems. And right after that, Brawl Stars changed the Brawl Pass where you can no longer buy it with gems, which is really unlucky. Not like they really need it because they could just gem everything anyways. He knew Mortis pretty well, huh? Oh, wow. Well, look at this guy. Ha! <laughs> All right, I like that. Top post number eight. New weekend event back to the beta idea. This is something that a lot of games do, like Clash Royale did it recently. Of course, Fortnite did it. A lot of games do this when they become really oversaturated with updates and there's a bunch of new stuff and some players just want to go back to the roots of the game and with this we can do that with only the original brawlers, no auto aim and no star powers, no gadgets, the original game modes. I think this would be really fun. I feel like they'll do it eventually. Post number nine is this person's idea on what hypercharge is. And I feel like this idea of what hypercharge is, is a lot better than what hypercharge actually is. This is what I was really praying hypercharges would be. And this is not what they ended up being. They could still get a rework one of these days, but I feel like they won't. Post number 10, nothing happened here. <laughs> 031 Edgar. <laughs> Post number 11, bro thought he clicked play on foot brawl. <laughs> I remember this post, but I don't remember what he does. I'm guessing he just runs up. Yeah, he just runs straight into the enemy spawn. I like how everybody's missing him though. Like what is bro doing? <laughs> Post number uh, 12, I think. Happy 2023, everyone. This was about exactly a year ago. Well, that's kind of outdated now, don't you think? <laughs> We're gonna see this exact same post for 2024. Didn't moved an inch. The most skilled tick player in Brawl Star history. Sometimes you just don't have to. If they don't have a thrower, they don't have an assassin. What are they gonna do? How are they gonna get in? Oh, maybe like that. Nope, the game ended. <laughs> he never had to move an inch. <laughs> I've lost count, but we have 
sarcastic spinners getting what they deserved. It is uh, 61% to 99. That's kind of tragic. But, I mean, I'm assuming they're going to get clapped from trolling too much, and then they're going to get killed. That was really close. Oh my gosh. Wait, this is way too close. They almost got in so many times. I think we're on number 13. Would you lose? Nah, I'd camp. Shelly. Fantastic. Uh, great number 14, 13, whatever. Number 15, I think. Who let this Rosa into Minecart Madness? Uh, <laughs> oh no. Post number 16. <laughs> Recent updates in Supercell games be like Diamond Pass, limited resources from Raid Metals, ugly interface, and full of bags. Supercell knocking on Brawl Stars door. Did that happen? Uh, would you count something like hypercharges as this? Let me know in a comment. Oh yeah, this was that update. All right, yeah, we did get it. Can we all agree that Charlie is the single most toxic brawler ever made? That kind of ties into this. So maybe they were knocking on Brawl Stars door. It all makes sense. She did get nerfed. She's still annoying. Post number, uh, we'll say 17. After all these years, B full hair reveal. I kind of like it when they randomly decide to do this. I don't remember if we've had a El Primo face reveal yet, but that should be next if it hasn't already happened. This one's a little recent. Pekka Surge, I remember looking at this. We got uh, level one, level two. Uh, I skipped level three, <laughs> level four. Yeah, pretty sick. We love these. Played 53 games with a random. That's insane. With win streaks, this might get even higher now. The apples and oranges meme made it to like the top 20 of the entire year. <laughs> I can't believe that. Two months ago, Brawl Stars in 2025. I remember this post and uh, it's uh, slowly becoming legitimately true. 11 months ago, how to solve the problem with the shortage of coins and the uselessness of star points for progression. Gold mines. <laughs> Nice. Six months ago, all these accounts are mine on this page. This took so long. I don't even know how you had the time for this, but I think I remember this post one year ago. Top five reasons why I main Sandy, my beloved. He is sleep deprived like me. I remember this post. Two, he does not have a losing animation. He is a Chad. He doesn't? Three, he shares Leon Super with teammates. So cool. Four, he has spike slippers in one of his skins. Five, he throws pebbles and rocks. I like the rock. Five amazing reasons. When Cordelius was first released, he was even more broken and with teaming than he is now because he could still get his super back in his super, which was kind of interesting for them to implement in the first place because I don't know how that makes sense why he would be able to get it back. Yeah, you could cycle it forever and it's just you two. So every lobby you'd see this, there would just be a bunch of people sitting in a corner farming, nothing personal. Uh, uh Rico punching in your face. Piper's crying. Isn't Rico supposed to be in love with her? I don't know what's going on. Are you you bullying Piper and Rico is putting on his fedora and squaring up? Post number whatever, uh, five months ago. Tell us your balance change opinions. Yeah, this one is uh, a bit outdated. Let's scroll down. This one really turned around, didn't it? Aged like milk for all stars community. This game is pay to win. No, Asherel community. This game is pay to win. Lamau. Yes. I think the Brawl Stars gang has uh, officially joined the Clash Royale gang at this point. Still though, I think Clash Royale is more pay to win. What is this? <laughs> I couldn't tell you. And of course, I remember this more than anything else because I absolutely hate it. This one still shows up everywhere because this one is just amazing. <laughs> I love this, this post. I think this one was in the intros of one of my videos. Brawl Stars players watching their game get five dog poop updates in a row after laughing at Clash Royale. Did this streak continue? I don't know because this last update was... Uh, one of my favorite ever. Fraud alert. Let's see who it really is. Two rares. Oh, that was uh, probably the first time they ever did the double star drop event and uh, everyone complained. <laughs> it was so laggy that the credits pop up. I remember this bug six months ago. Bo had this weird bug that came out of nowhere where you could place infinite mines. Usually it should replace them, but he eventually does tripwire. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Why did it go to the credits? Let's go get them all. Uh, yeah, common Brawl Stars W. To market the release of Sul Sultan Carl, we will also be donating $100,000 to charities working here on, on the ground, providing earthquake disaster relief in Turkey and Syria. Pretty cool. I remember this. Nine months ago. I cannot believe it's been nine months. I think he went 0 and 11 and he got all of the things. I don't want to fully open the post because it ruins the resolution and it looks ugly, but yeah, that's probably what happened here. Average thumbs down user. Yeah. He's going to get clapped, right? Okay, well, awesome. Let me just see him die. And? 
Yep, there it is. <laughs> the thumbs down. <laughs> this is when Kudos was a baby boy. Your Kudos can get on fire if you receive them from all the players. Stuff like this is common knowledge nowadays. Skin concept. Dionys Dionysus Rico. I don't remember if I've even seen this one. Wow, I just mumbled rap god, bro. Got grapes everywhere. And then he shoots grapes. One month ago, Mega Pig Rewards. The thinnest slice of bread possible. <laughs> I don't remember if they've even gotten changed at all. But I feel like people are kind of starting to warm up to it now that they got lucky like one time. I got lucky in my first one ever. On my mini, I think I got Sandy for my first thing that I ever opened. It was pretty cool. All right, this will be the last post. Supercell. Just why? <laughs> Manga versus anime versus Netflix adaptation. <laughs> the skin had a good concept. I agree that the final result, her face looks a little goofy. I don't know if it's her eyes or the, the nose or the mouth or a combination. Just a little goofy, a little funny, a little ah ha ha That is the top like 30-ish posts of the year. Sorry, I stopped counting. I got lazy and I also lost count like 10 times. But yeah, all things considered, pretty good year. There were some ups, there were some downs. Subscribe if you haven't already. 2024, we're hitting 1 million. Don't take me by my word, but I'm gonna push for it. All right, I'll see you later. Bye guys. Uh, happy new year, even though I'm posting another video after this. Yeah, bye.